In this video, I'm going to show you one of the most common applications for installing roofing foil, and that's under a typical metal replacement roof, either an overlay or a tear-off on an existing home or building. Now, roofing foil is the underlayment that pays for itself. Remember, your house is just a big box sitting in the sun. You get a disproportionate amount of heat through the top of the box. When you install roofing foil inside the roofing assembly, it's going to reflect the radiant heat. Now, the radiant heat is the invisible part of the light spectrum, it's the part you feel, not the part that you see. So we're not trying to reflect the light. We're trying to reflect the heat. The roofing foil reflects 97% of radiant heat. So basically, it's like putting the house in the shade or a really cloudy day. Roofing foil does cost a little bit more than other underlayment, but guaranteed, it's going to pay for itself in six months or a year in both energy savings and comfort. So let's get into the actual install process. As you can see in this picture, they're installing the metal panel over a batten system. They're using a two by four battens. Looks like it's probably on 24 inch on center. Now this is the roof before they did the tear off and this is the finished product. This is the tear off in process. You can see they're scraping it clean. Uh, they're gonna get all the way down to the roof deck. Assuming the roof deck is in good condition, no repairs. They're gonna make sure all the nails are out. They're gonna blow it off really well. And then they're gonna start installing the underlayment. Traditional underlayment, start at the bottom, overlap three or four inches, work your way up so you're not bucking water and go all the way up and over the ridge. This is just the second row continuing up to the top. And here's an example of an overlay. And you can actually see in this area right here, you got the old existing uh, shingle roof, assuming it's in good condition, you can go directly over that roof, no problem. Here's an example of the roofing foil installed in a cold climate in Montana. Uh, works great in either hot or cold climates. Uh, this is a great example of a house where the guy doesn't have air conditioning, but there's a couple weeks of the year where he kind of wish he did. Foil basically makes the, the house comfortable late in the afternoon on those few weeks when you get those hot summer days. So he can basically offload that heat, keep the home cooler, and not need air conditioning. Here's another picture of the home in Montana. So as far as the install process, they're starting the two by fours, uh, the battens on the drip edge, installing that, and they're gonna work their way up. Now, if you're cutting the wood on the roof, one good thing is to use a leaf blower. You wanna blow off as much as the sawdust as possible. You wanna keep the roofing foil as clean as possible. They're installing the bottom metal on the porch, and then here they're installing the um, flashing, making that transition between the porch and the slope. Next, they're gonna start mechanically attaching on the slope. Now, roofing foil is super durable. You can walk on it, it's not gonna tear. It's Miami-Dade approved. So it can actually be used in areas that are hurricane prone. It's kind of the gold standard for any type of roofing underlayment. With your battens on the 18 or 24 inch on center using a typical 26 gauge metal, you can easily walk on it without causing any damage. And notice in this picture how the roofing foil goes up and over the ridge. Now what they're going to do at some point, they're going to come in and they're going to cut a big slit there um, for the ridge vent, for the, uh, for the hot air to vent out of that attic. They're going to continue on until they're done. And that is the finished roof. And another picture from the front and another one. So installing roof and foil is the best and fastest way for a typical overlay of a metal roof on an existing roof, whether you do a tear-off or you do an overlay. So for more information, visit roofingfoil.com.